in this problem, we are dividing exponents with the same bases. And you may already know that if you multiply exponents with the same bases, you actually add the exponent part to get the new exponent. With division, it might not surprise you, it's the opposite. So instead of adding these exponents, we're going to subtract them. But I'm going to show you this the long way first, and then we'll do it with that shortcut of subtraction, and you'll see how it comes out to be the same thing. So let's look at the top here. We have a to the 6. That's a multiplied by itself 6 times. So that's the top, a to the 6th. On the bottom, we have a to the 4th. So a times a times a times a. And you may know that if you've got something uh, the same on the top and the bottom, when all the things are multiplied, you can cancel. So this a cancels with this a, this a cancels with this a, this a cancels with this a, this a cancels with this a. And we just have those two a's multiplied by each other left. And so our answer is a squared. If we did this uh, by subtracting exponents, we'd come up with the same thing. This would be a to the 6 instead of, um, you know, this is a to the 6 divided by a to, four, a to the 4th. So instead of division, we do 6 minus 4. So a to the 6 minus 4 power is a squared. So that is how to divide a power by another power when the bases are the same.